For his main course, Nick's serving venison with game gravy. Very happy about the main course. Um, and I got some new venison in, which wasn't as good. But I've actually just found the old bits and we've just trimmed them up. And it's much better because it's been hung longer, so it's going to be more tender and it's going to have a better flavour. And I've got exactly enough for three portions. <laughs> so if I cock it up, you know, I'll be in trouble. Please, to be very, very careful with these because they will fall over. Could that be a problem at a big banquet? Uh, yeah, I'm doing a bit poncy than I'd normally do at a big banquet. OK. Guys, okay, please, go. please, please, keep these plates straight, OK? If you don't, the gravy is going to go all the way up the side, OK? And it's going to look minging. <laughs> oh. Oh, Rishi. Smells good. A little um, purrs of pleasure coming out of Oliver. That is beautifully cooked. Mm. What they've got is a very, very good quality ingredient, which is cooked well, right? Yes, that's right. I mean, it's accompanied by vegetables which actually go well with it enormously well. And you know what? This dish sounded very heavy, didn't it? Yeah, it did. In, in actual fact, it's not heavy at all. Absolutely lovely. Mm. No, it's a very good dish. Again, what I really like about this is it's, it's, it's very restrained. Yeah. There's nothing added there for effect. There's a great danger I'll eat it all. Oh, brew. <laughs> What a terrible thing. <laughs> well, the venison seems to be winning the judges over, but down in the kitchen, Tom desperately needs his beef to cook in time. The heat's on. Or is it? You're going to need half an hour in the oven, half an hour to rest. Yeah? Do you know what I mean? Huh? That's going to need at least half an hour to cook. And half an hour to rest. And half an hour to rest, you got 45 minutes. So, I mean, I'm, I'm at two, 260. This has a horrible oven. I, I don't like, I mean, I know my ovens, you know? Yeah. Oh, that's hot! While Tom battles with the oven, the judges continue to shower Nick's venison with praise. That's just good. It does what it says on the packet. It does what it says on the packet. And it says, says the virtues of restraint and very accurate cooking. Tom's making roast sirloin of highland beef with vegetables and a radish relish. So is Nick worried by the competition? Venison versus beef. Roast veg versus little baby things. So mine's quite robust and chunky. His is a bit nincy tinsy So he seems fairly confident, but Tom's still battling against the clock. Tomas, how's your beef, mate? <laughs> bit pink. It'll be fine. I have to be honest, this oven, I've just not got the hang of it. My beef's a little bit undercooked. Yeah. But, you know, we tell the judges, I mean, they'll still be chewing on your venison, so that should buy me five or ten more minutes, you know? So, yeah. In your dreams. Hello. Uh -huh. Hello, Tom. <laughs> this is the moment. Is it going to be all right? It's got that. <gasps> That's OK. That one is. There's <laughs> three people. Right. It's going to be all right, isn't it, Nick? I think he's just going to sclap through. I'd use those two. If I got served that, I'd be over the moon. Hey! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,